Good morning to all. I welcome you all to this didactic program. Thirukkurlood Naam Attending in fact with a noble desire to reach the seat of grace in life by practicing the ethical values of Thiruvalluva. Topic number 1056 Chapter Mendicancy Lord Buddha was on opposite to Shavatsi. During the period, there was acute famine in the town and people suffered without food. Though there were a number of rich people in the town, none came forward to feed the poor people. They thought that if they extended help at that time, then they would also suffer after some period of time due to declining status of wealth on feeding the poor. One day, Lord Buddha met many rich people at a place and asked as to whether there was no thought in their minds to help the poor during the famine. The people maintained silence to the words of Lord Buddha. Lord Buddha asked them to break their silence to his question and reply in much louder voice. A small girl rose in the crowd and said that she was there to help the poor. The crowd looked at the small girl with a surprise. Lord Buddha asked as to how she could help the poor and the girl said that she could help the poor people in the town. The girl told Lord Buddha that her father was rich and he would not help the poor. So she decided to go door to door back for resources with the rich following the principles of dharma and with that she could feed the poor people the girl as promised went door to door begged for kinds and money the act of a small girl touched the hearts of the rich people and this changed their minds they came forward and gave away many things to the poor people to eliminate their poverty Due to this, the famine that struck the town was completely eradicated. If a person comes forward without hiding what he has, then the sufferings from the poverty for people will vanish totally. Our Saint Tamil poet Thiruvalluvar explains about this in his Thirukkural as follows: Karappidumbai yillarai kaanin, nirappidumbai yellam oranga kedum. I recite. Refusing to share resources is sad. Willing to share resources is good. Thank you very much indeed. Nandri Vanakkam.